Hi, I'm ProScaper1232, and I'm the real Zezima14. And welcome to the most overdue rentation in the history of the Yatabi, which Lego Pixel people like us can't pronounce properly. The Felix company failed again by updating Castle Wars, so that you can get new shitty rewards that don't do much. Yeah, I mean, why would you use a Ceratum and Halo when you can just wear a vest as long as word on your head and look like an even bigger jackass? That makes too much sense. Not as much sense as the new catapults in Castle Wars. They are too underpowered though, because it takes a full one second to kill all the 60 people standing in the center. The Publix needs to change this so that it hits everywhere on the map and does at least 1100 damage per shot so that it can one hit a steel titan that has been glued to Girthjar's arm. If the Publix company does not fix this before I go to my court hearing for killing 9001 dairy owners, then we will riot world 66 Falader until the Jublix gives us old wildy back please oops I mean more powerful castle wars. This is guaranteed to work because riotations have worked so well in the past like when people rioted about dual arena changes so the Publix removed free trade and wilderness. We pay we say good fight. HMG WTF BBQ is a good jazz? I don't know, I think he used to be on the top of the high scores, but it looks like he has become addicted to the real life MMORPG. Maybe he should see a psychiatrist. The real life MMORPG fictional universe is going downhill anyway ever, since the IRL cheesy oops I mean Chessy 018 told her fail merch clan called the BP Oil Company to dump 915 gigatons of oil onto the real life market to cause the price to drop. Unfortunately, Chessy's non-pixelated worshippers are all fucking retarded and thought that she meant to dump 915 gigatons of oil into the Gulf of Mexico. Because they are all too lazy to dump oil properly they just use Dark Bow Special Attack Descent of Darkness with Adamant Arrows on oil rig causing the oil rig to collapse in the ocean causing the IRL gigabills of GP of damage good fight. At least she didn't invest in Calcut tree seeds again because that would have been even worse. Ever since the oil spill now called the 2010 Chessie 018 Deepwater Horizon oil spill, lots of fish players and seal players and seagull players have been making the rentations on the real life official forums that the oil spill is causing them to get glitched and randomly die and lose 51 noted blue party hits that they promised that. They did not make up and want to be reimbursed by the IRL Jagex called the United Nations. While I think that talking about an oil rig being destroyed by adamant arrows is about as unrelated to the castle wars as possible. My uncle in the real life MMORPG is ranting in Paris on World 66 because he spent 36 years of his life playing the real life 24 hours a day to get 99 fishing so that he can make 250k an hour. But ever since the oil spill that was because of Chessy 018. He can only fish oily fish which are untradeable on the real life grand exchange called the Wall Street. This means that all he can do is power fish oily fish and lose money that he spends on the bait which is pointless in a way because he already has 99 fishing. Basically, both the RuneScape and the IRL games are going downhill, so I think that everyone should quit both games and go play the Dora the Purple Dinosaur Explorer High Five Wiggles Dragon Claws See You in Lumbee Thomas the Tank Engine MMORPG which is obviously better because I said so. What we have learned today is that everything can either be blamed on Jagex or Chessy018 and everything can be solved by riotations and quitting the real life online game. K thanks longest ranch and ever too long did not read oops I mean listen, 